The National Space Academy has been around for about 15 years now. We employ teachers all across the country and we're dedicated to providing inspirational scientific experiences uh, that are linked to the curriculum. So from last year's symposium where we were essentially training a lot of people in how to use the kit and what it was all about, we've now delivered uh, over 370 masterclasses and this was a real opportunity for the space advocates to come together and start to bring their own ideas to it to start to uh, take what we've given them and go further with it and to start having ideas to what we should do in the future. One of the best things about running a masterclass is being able to work with the young people but to inject a certain enthusiasm that is infectious, one hopes, and gets them interested into STEM and thinking a bit longer term to what they might be able to do outside of the classroom. I just love coming together with so many other people that share that passion. Um, it's great whenever we come together and we discuss what went well, we, we then can share what that didn't go well for me as well. And you, you start to realise that there's a real community sense here. We're all in it to help each other. We're all here with the same vision. And it's so good just to have those so many minds in the same room all at the same time. But coming to these events, sharing ideas, uh, has really helped my teaching and I hope really improved some of the teaching of the people behind me as well. So the Space to Learn project is exciting for the UK Space Agency because we like to support young people and teachers to engage with the awe-inspiring and incredibly useful space sector uh, and to inspire the next generation to think about taking up careers in space. We should be passionate about space because space is everywhere and space is for everyone. From the mobile phones that we use to climate change to farming and ocean tracking, it provides such a lot of benefits and value to our economy and just um, society's whole, so it's very exciting. I think it's been great to hear the level of conversation and chat that there's been today between the space advocates who've all got different experiences and, and today with our cluster skills leads, hearing them discuss what their own particular issues are, how we can help, how they can help us. That collaboration that's beginning to develop is just so exciting. And having had this germ of an idea this time last year, I'm just so excited about where it's going to go in the future.